Just a disclaimer, I suck at vlogging. <laughs> this is my moving into my college dorm vlog. Just some tips and tricks that I learned moving in and stuff that I did beforehand because I was moving to a different city. Um, I did forget to film the intro beforehand, so here we are now in my college dorm filming the intro. I really do suck at vlogging. I forgot to film a lot, and so a lot of it is just after what I've done, explaining what I did um, type of stuff. So let's just get right into the video. Also, a lot of the clips are in really weird lighting. I don't have a good camera or a microphone. This video is going to be a little rough. I'm sorry. Hey guys, it is now three days away from, or two days away from my moving day. And uh, today was my last shift at my favorite job. Um, I cried. Just had my last shift at my favorite job. So we have three days till I move. And so far, this is how much we have packed. All of that. And then this I will be filling up with what's in my closet. And then all of this is gifts I got from my going away party the other day. And then also today I received my crown box. It has my crown in it and my sash. <laughs> hey guys, so we officially have tomorrow and then I move. And that's all of my stuff. Well, not all of it, but most of it. Um, right now we're, my car is, um, at the shop getting a tire realignment because it's messed up. <laughs> so today I've just been packing and finishing my car and cleaning my room. Lexi, say hi. Hey. You can't eat my cookie. I'll be right. Lexi, show me the cat. Cat. Dog. Cat. Dog. Where's the other dog? Where's the dog? Over there. Mom? Dad? Gecko? Gecko. Gecko. Cat? Where's the dog? Dog. <laughs> hey guys, so it is the day before I leave, so I leave tomorrow. Um, it is currently 8 o'clock, and I finished my last shift at my job, JCPenney. Um, I had worked there for a year and today was my last shift so I brought in uh, goodbye cookies for all my coworkers and managers. Um, I went and I filled up my gas tank and I got a car wash so I'm all ready for tomorrow. I just gotta wake up, um, get ready, load my stuff in my car and then I'm off <laughs> to college. So yeah, I guess I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Hey guys, so it is my official last day here in the town that I live in. Um, it is about like 10.30ish, I think, 9.30ish, and um, I leave tomorrow morning. My room is empty. Yeah, it is like really empty. It's starting to echo in here. I got everything out of my closet. Still looks really full, but um, that's just a lot of my pageant dresses and stuff like that. Um, I emptied out my bathroom. All oh, that's my sister's. That's my side. <laughs> day is the day. It is moving day. Lexi, what day is it? Lexi. The seventh. <laughs> you need to be more hype than that, Lex. It's the seventh of August. Yeah. So I woke up this morning. I showered and. I just now finished loading my car. My room is empty, empty. And so we should, it's about a three hour drive. So we should be leaving here really soon. My roommate is already there cause she lives closer to the dorm than I do. And she says that none of the keys are working right now for anybody. So hopefully they'll have that fixed by the time I get there. Yeah. And let's see. I told you guys I would show you the back in the morning when you could actually see. That is everything. That is all of my life in a car. And then over there, my parents are getting the other car loaded with my bike, some snacks, 
um, I don't know, some other stuff that my mom was talking about earlier. <sighs> so yeah, kind of nervous, kind of excited. Um, it's kind of weird that this is my last day in a town that I've lived in for 18 years. You ready, mama? Hi. Hi. What day is it? Today's moving day. Moving day? How are you feeling? I'm sad. You're sad? I miss you already. Aww. <laughs> Dad, I need to interview you. You do? Yeah? What for? The vlog. I'm recording this entire experience. I've been doing it since we started working on my car. Okay. Okay, what's today? Today is the day that Devin goes to Albuquerque to start the new leg of her journey. And how are you feeling about it? Um, I feel excited for her. I feel pretty good. <laughs> I think she'll do really well. I think she'll learn a lot and she'll be successful. And I don't really want her to go, but no. time to kick her out of the nest. Uh, uh, how do you feel about me leaving? Huh, buddy? How do you feel? Duke, princess, how do you feel? Do you know what today is? Do you know, huh? Bye, puppies. Bye, puppies. Bye-bye. Penelope, how do you feel about me leaving? Huh, Mama? Penelope? Penelope? You won't look at the camera. Okay, Lexi, what is today? I already answered this question. Okay, move-in day! Okay, um... How do you feel about me moving in, me leaving? Um, sad, I guess. Sad? Yeah. That's all? Oh! <laughs> Nor my cat trying to commit gecko murder on camera. Gecko, do you know what day it is? Gecko, is that, I don't give it. <laughs> Are you gonna miss me, Gecko? No. How do you feel about me leaving? No feelings. <laughs> It's empty. Kind of sad to look at. I found the cat! Okay, we are finally all loaded up in the car and we're getting ready to go. Right now it is literally my favorite weather outside. It's just starting to sprinkle, so I think my town's saying goodbye. Um, we're gonna go to the gas station first, top off our tanks and then we'll be on our way. Um, it is exactly three hours and one minute um, to the hotel, and I think it's two hours and 28 minutes to the university. So we are about one hour away from my school, and there's this little shack right over there. Um, that's, that is called Blake's, it's a hamburger, restaurant in New Mexico in New Mexico and that's where we're eating but they don't have a bathroom so then we tried the subway that's right there they don't have a bathroom so we're walking all the way to Walmart in a town that we've never been in <laughs> so it's all fun and games hey guys so today has been absolutely hectic so I have not recorded it is now I think seven eight ish I have no idea what time it is um, so basically, we finished driving over here. We got checked in, which was an absolute mess. And so far, this is my dorm. I'll give you a better tour later on. But um, basically, there's supposed to be one person on this side of the room and one person on this side of the room. But because of Corona, they only allow one person per room. You know what, let me give you the tour. That might be easier to explain. <laughs> okay, so. Hello. So we have one closet over here and one closet on this side. Then over here we have our microwave, our refrigerator, and just like a little kitchen area. I moved the furniture around. This is not what it originally looked like, but we have some dressers over here, desk area over here, nightstand, the beds, plural. This is two beds put together because this was supposed to be one bed area for one person and this is supposed to be a bed area for another person. But because of COVID, there's only one person per room. And this is like the little TV area. And then if you go in through here, so that's where we entered. If you go in through here, hi Lex. Hi. Okay, so if you go in through here, 
This is the shower area. And then here is my sinks, my bathroom area. Yes, it is entirely a mess. I have not done much. This is my um, roommate stuff. And then in there is the bathroom. Hey guys, so it's day two of moving in. Um, <laughs> so there's this thing here. And then some of your phone <laughs> falls off the bed. <laughs> she oh, thinks she's fun. hilarious. No. Okay. It is day two of moving into my dorm. It is quite a mess, but we have all the furniture moved around to how I want it. Lexi stopped twerking. <laughs> Um, <laughs> so we had dinner with my roommate's family last night. She's my pageant sister. So, um, we both have a pageant title. So, yeah, it should be a fun year. Is that a there are so Lexi, say hi! <laughs> okay, so I have been a really, really bad vlogger. Um, it is day three, so it is the 9th of August. I moved in on the 7th. Um, that day was really hectic. It was really hard to get, um, all checked in and stuff like that, especially since I was doing it. My appointment time was at four, so most things were already closed by then. <laughs> they did not plan that out very well. And then, um, so I got my ID card. I'm still working on getting my parking pass just because I don't have everything I need for my car. And on the 8th, we just did a little bit more moving in. We went shopping for some things that I didn't have. Um, yeah, so we pretty much got everything all settled. I just need to clean up a little bit. My sister spent the night with me last night, so her stuff's all over the place. My dad's currently trying to set up the DV. We got a new one because my old one was really, well, old, and it didn't work really well. I got my bathroom all set up. This, okay, so my dorm does not have very good lighting anywhere like they did not spend a lot of money on lighting so we got this thing for the bathroom and it's super bright so uh, yesterday we went food shopping got a bunch of food i have a miniature fridge and a miniature microwave i got my keurig to make coffee and hot chocolate because i'm not really a coffee person and then that's the view if it'll load there we go not load focus there we go um so yeah, that's my bed. Dad, say hi. Hi. Terrible, terrible vlogger, as you guys saw. Anyway, um, it's the end of the video, and I also didn't film an outro, so here we are. Those three days, or four days, were really crazy, really hectic, which moving anywhere really is. It is now, like, I've been living here for, like, oh, five days already? Yeah, five days already. I love it so far. Dorm life is definitely different, happier, cleaner for me. Um, I kind of get OCD over certain things, and so my room has been clean. I doubt that it will stay that way when school actually starts in three days. Um, I like looking out the window and being able to like see people walking around. You know, You're never really alone because you're on campus. I have definitely made friends. It's kind of hard. Some people are putting their Snapchats outside their doors to make friends. I know a lot of my neighbors because of that. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching, and I hope uh, that was helpful at least a little bit. <laughs> and I will see you next time.